for to say it could roll the favourite. Last and being locked away here. Green light is there. Bunny rolls. We're set for a break. Grafton race seven. Ready. Racing. Clancy's Tavern was away quickly. Beginning well was Flash Attic. Punching up between runners, the favourite party mode, Phantom Bob. Now, wide of those was Aussie Fury. Milkman Mav drifting well out of it. Orson Storm and Robbie Lola. Leader still Clancy's Tavern. Party mode still out after it. Flash Attic around those. Next was Robbie Lola into the straight. Clancy's Tavern drifts off. Gives the run to party mode. He powers on through. Party mode gets the job done. Beats the flying Robbie Lola. Clancy's Tavern third in front of Flash Attic. Behind those was Aussie Fury, Milkman Mav, Phantom Bob, Orson Storm at the tail, 25 and 70. Whoa, tough watch, I reckon, if you took the shorts, but he's got the prize. Party mode gets home from box number four. <laughs> you sort of knew he was there. The race was there for him to win. You're just waiting for him to, to take charge, and it took all of the straight for him to put the race to bed, party mode. He's got home for favourite backers, defeating Rob Lola, who's rushed home again from box number eight for second. Third to one, Clancy's Tavern. He's probably run her best race for a while. And fourth to number five, Flash Attic. Four, eight, one and five, the interim placings. A half length, the winning margin. A half length, one length between second and third. That time again, 25.71 with splits of 9.12, 20.04, 567 on the way home. 4, 8, 1 and 5, the interim result. Party mode, the Black Dog, Feral, Frankie, Katanga Eve. For Lance Day and Craig Gardol, defeats 8, Rob L. Lola, Ben Ellis. 3rd to 1, Clancy's Tavern for Sally Whelan. And 4th was number 5, Flash Attic. 4, 8, 1 and 5, a half by 1, 25, 71 the time on Grafton race number 7. All clear on the numbers four, eight, one and five. It's all clear to pay Grafton race seven.